I'd like to uh, emphasize through my presentation how important to uh, keep the <laughs> persistency for each uh, interest. Yeah, in my case, uh, I was interested in the royalties and I continued the research until it becomes available for the all the people. So uh, I'd like to uh, uh, send a message to the young people. Uh, the continuation is very important for the research. Due, due to the achievement of blue LEDs, uh, we can realize uh, L white LEDs. Uh, it's a general lighting. It can be used as a general lighting system and efficiency. The point is the efficiency. Uh, we, we can fabricate LED lamp. The efficiency is eight times higher than that of incandescent lamp or two times higher than that of fluorescent lamp. So by replacing the general lighting, conventional lighting system to LED lighting system, we can reduce energy consumption. That's one of the most important uh, advantage of LEDs. Uh, of course, the performance is much, much higher than that of other uh, writing system, but the problem is the cost. Yeah, so the cost reduction is most important in future or <laughs> to, to adapt or to accelerate the, uh, the penetration of the LED to the market. So some Asian country, uh, but, but the, the for LED lighting system, the, uh, the Japan has the first priority to, to use the or replace LED lighting system. One of the reasons is the earthquake. But by earthquake, the many Japanese think that the, the conventional lighting system is not sufficient for, for protecting the earthquake. The, LED lighting system is more tolerant or more <laughs> tough against the earthquake. That's why the many Japanese people think that we should replace to the LED lighting system. There is a big desert in the northern area and it such kind of wide place space is very good for the solar cell, mega or giga solar cell systems. The solar system is very good uh, with the LEDs, displays. So the Chile is one of the best country to apply LEDs and solar cells. After the blue LEDs, we have developed the UV LEDs. The purpose is purified water. We can sterilize the bacterium by irradiating the UV light, ultraviolet light. This is our second uh, development. And the third development we are now considering is the power conversion system. You, for example, you use the solar cells. The solar cell is the DC source, direct current. Yes. The, the voltage is stable. But in our house, we use the AC, alternative current. Okay? The, the voltage changes. Uh, so we need a power conversion system. And Today's power conversion system, the efficiency is still not uh, ideal. By changing the conventional device to our new device, we can further reduce the electricity loss to 0.5% or 0. less than 0.5%. So it's almost 
unity, 100% compassion can be possible. <laughs> so no, now we are fabricating and developing a new power compassion system, which is very effective for combining solar cells to our homemade use electricity.